The final position of the setout points can be checked against the design in a number of ways. We'll have a look at three ways. Firstly, we're going to read in an ASCON Survey 12D ASCII file. File I.O. Data Input 12DA4DA. Click on the folder icon, select Browse and go back up to the Setout folder and select Road ASCON Survey.12DA. We click Read, then Finish. If we were to turn off the design data, you'll see we have a series of points here. The first thing we're going to look at is being able to check design points versus as constructed points. To do this we're going to use the model electric light as our design and if you move in closer and inquire on each of those we have a model called ELEC light and we have one called design light. So we've done an as constructed reading to our light once we've set it out. We'll just turn on the road alignment as we're going to report the errors as a change in offset. So we select the option reports, QA reports, check survey points versus design points. The design, the survey model will be ELEC light, the design will be design light, and the report file we will we will call lights ascon we're going to look 0.5 of a meter around each survey point to try to find a design point we're going to set our tolerance method to chainage offset and we need to pick the control string where the chainage will be measured from so we pick on the alignment string we're going to type in a 50 millimeter change tolerance and also an offset tolerance so it will flag them if they're outside the tolerance. We're also going to use an elevation tolerance of 30 millimeters. Go to the setting tab now and we're going to there's some information here about setting up the actual uh, widths of the text we'll leave them as we'll leave all them as defaults there's also the ability to report the design coordinates which we want to do so we tick on that and we also are going to create a CSV file so we tick on the CSV file and click run. If we go back to the main tab now and open up the report file we'll now see a CSV of our results We'll now look at checking as-built strings versus design strings, so we'll click finish on this panel. We'll turn off the design light and electric light. And we're going to use the option reports, QA reports, check as-built string versus design string. For this tutorial here, we'll also turn on the Smith Street strings, as we'll need to uh, pick the design string. So the as-built string will be the road edge pavement, the design string will be the Smith Street strings named EOBR, the control string will be the alignment string and you may have to pick this twice to get the alignment. We'll change the difference units to meters and three decimal places. The report interval will be 5, the start change 0, the end change will be 40 and we're going to look only 100 millimeters either side of the string. Now this is actually in millimeters so we type in 100 for 100 millimeters. We then give it a report file name so we just call it pavement edge ASCON and click report. If we want to open the report file so I'll just open it in a text editor and you'll see the as-built information in both relative to the actual points and in a specific change increment.
The last one we're going to look at will be comparing these points here against a design 10. To do this we use the option reports, QA reports, checkpoints versus 10. We pick the model of the shots which will be the topo surface level points. We're checking them against the Smith Street 10 and the above tolerance will be 10 millimeters and the below tolerance will be 10 millimeters. We're going to type in a report file name pavement ASCON we're going to report the chainage offset to the center line pick on the alignment string and pick on the alignment and click report again going into the working folder we can have a look at the report file and you'll see a list of the chainage offset as built coordinates with design height the as built coordinates easting northing and level and the design level and then the differences anything outside the tolerance is flagged here and over on the right we have the name of the point